Hi guys, absolutely buzzing to tell you today that I've been selected to go to the World Championships, it's official now. It's been a long, tough process in this team selection and I think this year it's definitely been the toughest selection Great Britain have ever had. The depth of the squad is incredible. However, I'm on the team. I can't be happier. And first of all, I just want to thank everyone for the support. You guys are part of my motivation and inspiration. Saturday just gone. We had the final trial and I scored a PB of 89.2, which I was really, really happy with. And it's exciting moving forward. We, we go to Glasgow next Monday. The first qualification competition for us is on the 25th of October. So it's really close now and um, it's a relief to be selected and now I can just focus on the job in hand. It's so exciting, you know, the experience I had last year in China was absolutely incredible. The world stage, it doesn't get any bigger than that and the environment is just where I absolutely thrive and love. And, you know, it's any gymnast dream, that's, that's where you, that is the goal for any gymnast, I'm sure. In this video, I wanted to do a little, almost a little bit of a journey to this point and being selected. Six weeks ago, I hurt my shoulder, got injured, and this was a huge question mark to the whole process and it threw a spanner in the works and um, it made me step back and remind myself, you know, why am I doing this? And I, I think I'd almost just got into the habit of awake in sleep and I wasn't as focused as I should have been. On, on what my end goal was and, and this this does happen sometimes and it'll happen to you in the future and I think it was a, a blessing in disguise for me to actually as I said step back and remind myself you know now what are you doing this for think about the end goal are you focused enough are you eating properly are you training properly and this is what I did and managed to get myself fit enough and strong enough for three weeks later the injury and competed in the London Open which was the first trial and I hit a PB score at the time of 88.8 .8. so that was massive confidence and motivation for me and then moving forward the last three weeks since the London Open I just want to tell you guys a little bit what it's been like behind the scenes because the selection is fantastic you know the team that you see oh, it's fantastic but what we've had to go through in these last three weeks, midweek, every week, we're doing a high pressurised competition as a team at Little Shoreland National Training Centre. The Saturday following the London Open, we competed in France, uh, travelled by train very early morning, came back in a day, and went straight, travelled back home, travelled back to Little Shore, another comp midweek competition, and last Saturday, the Saturday just been, we did another competition against Spain which was a very high pressurised environment again, which I was so happy with. I want to show you some footage. I hit another PB score of 89.2. So for the last three weeks for me I've been steadily consistent and that's one of the reasons I'm in the team is showing that I'm um, hitting my best performances under the pressure again consistently. So I hope you're coming to watch it, it'd be great to see you there. If you haven't got tickets, they're available online, I'll leave a link to the website down below. I'd love to see you guys there and, and shouting for our team. And if it's anything like what the Commonwealth Games was in that same arena last year, you don't want to miss it. It, it was incredible. Let's have it, GB. Let's smash it. Um, remember, train smart, keep it real.